Hey there, Aries. Welcome to your reading for the week of July 20th. Uh, so this week you have some interesting stuff going on here. Uh, the first card you have is the Seven of Hearts, which shows up. And Seven of Hearts is, you know, it's interesting because I believe Venus has gone retrograde, if I'm not mistaken, or is going retrograde. Um, so this card can indicate feeling like a lack of love. Um you know, f from a partner, from just in general, uh, not having a relationship, for example, things like that can be, you know, having that effect on you. It is also, I mean, it is a positive card. It can indicate somebody's interested in you as well. So it kind of has both, um, you know, both feelings, but somebody wants to be complete. That's what the card means is it's the card itself feels incomplete. It wants to be an eight. I always say that about seven. Sevens want to either go up and be an eight or they want to come down and they want to be a six so it's not a complete card so somebody isn't feeling complete like i said so if you have an admirer out there they are feeling incomplete because you are not with them and uh if you are in a relationship for example you might just not be feeling love between your partner or something like that i think the energy is is passing i think it's going to be very quick it feels very quick i don't think it's something you have to worry about or anything like that and also just know that it's really i mean it's really not you um that's having those feelings it's just the energy that is kind of there and it's going to be passing and it's not a big deal uh, you have another seven coming up next so you know definitely playing on that seven energy this week um this is the seven of clubs it is a card that it does represent a little bit more um, of success. This is an ongoing trend for you, Aries. I think in your August reading was really great. Um, so, you know, I think the success is going to be s stepping in here. But um, the Seven of Clubs just represents, I mean, it usually typically represents working very hard, whether it be at your job, at your business, or if you don't have either of those things, it represents working hard to get one of those things, like a job or a business. But it also represents sometimes, um, you know, f uh, forgetting about the people that are important to you in your life or maybe those people not feeling like you are there for them. Um, because you're like focusing so much on on these other things so it's a card that just says try to also make sure not to forget about the other responsibilities that you have in life although you will be successful and i mean you will be successful like i said you had a great august and this week here for the 20th is is you know equally as great and like i said about sevens wanting to be eights you follow up with the eight of clubs which is a card of intuition it represents using your intuition to get the things you want and not just business wise um pretty much everything in your life it says that you will be very intuitive this week you will be using a lot of your kind of like psychic abilities even and in just your gut instincts to get through the week when it hap when it comes to like all situations it's a very mental card it represents you know using your brain to to get through obstacles it's not like a week where you're going to be able to use your muscles to get through obstacles it's more of a just mental strategic um this is all about strategy when it comes to all situations uh, everything um you know love if you're feeling a lack of love this card says well use your brain and become strategic about it and you will be able to get that love if you're lacking in money it says use your brain and you will get that money and and everything else like i said anything else in life that you could possibly want. Just use your brain uh, this week and you'll get it. And uh, to round out your week, you have the Ace of Diamonds, which is the best money card in the deck. It is very, uh, you know, it pretty much only has to do with money. So, you know, this represents money coming in, gaining money, getting more money this week. And it could come in in so many different ways. I mean, just judging by the other cards that you have here, I mean, this money could come in as a result of a lot of different situations you know your partner even if you're married or you're with somebody uh, you know your partner bringing in a lot of money that is a great possibility you yourself bringing in a lot of money you and your partner bringing in a lot of money it's you know it's all of that stuff together um, so you know this is a very pop positive card and it also represents a lot of stability I think you will be very stable even if you have some of these like seven like issues i think you know this seven issue right here you're not going to even worry about because you got the eight coming up right up next so it's going to just totally cancel it out 
The seven of hearts, you know, I don't even, it's not even that big of a problem. Like I said, it's a very quick energy. I think you'll be able to use your smarts and get through it very quickly. Um, but this right here brings in a great deal of stability other than that. So enjoy your week. You're going to have an amazing week. And, you know, thank you for watching this video.